Pokemon are at McDonald's and we're finally finished the set! Hooray! So this one we're going to be reviewing Zorua because Zorua's boring. Yeah, sorry Zorua fans. Okay, Zorua's not boring. But Zora is boring actually. Anyways, number 8 of the series. Let's open this up. Ah, silly me for thinking I could finish this in 5 seconds, 30 seconds, whatever. <laughs> Alright, continue opening this before we got interrupted. Hey, what's up Zorua? Let's check what card we got first. Uh, looks like our card is bent. Oh dear. Let's hope it's a Muna. Oh, what are the chances? Getting a Zorua toy and a Zorua card. It's a shame it's kind of bent, but uh, we'll see what we can do about that. And as for... The, oh, here. Anyone want a code? Take it. Uh, instructions! Alright. So my cousin has this, so I already know what it does. So uh, basically it hops. According to him, it's pretty hard to make it hop, so let's see how hard it is. Push back on his tail, I guess? And then... What? Oops. Is he supposed to click or something, or...? Right? Where's my Mima? There! Are you my Mima? Whoa! Alright, this sucks. Sorry. But yeah, this stinks. Uh, articulation wise, there's nothing articulating other than this hopping mechanism. Uh, I guess you could say he's nicely colored, nice paint job. But really, I don't know. Gosh. Tepig or Zoro, who's the worst toy? This is kind of disappointing. I mean, it's not the first time McDonald's has done something like this that makes a toy hop, but it's usually better than this, isn't it? Anyways, yeah, won't waste your time with that. And so here we are right now, seven, one more, and that'll be in the next video. Ah, uh, so here's Zorua. Oops, what else is new? Uh, here is Zoroark. As you can see, Zoroark is nice and slim, while Zorua is like such a fatty. Hey, let's see what happens if Zorua attacks Zoroark. Mima! Oh. Now let's see if there's an awe factor. Mima! Oh. Not that kind of awe. Meow! Okay. Oh, wow. I wish I could do this to him in the movie. But, uh... <laughs> All right. Okay, I'm, I'm failing. There we go. Didn't work exactly as how I wanted it to work. But anyway, stay tuned for the next review, Snivy, the final review. This one was pretty disappointed. I'm gonna have to think. Who's more disappointing, Tepig or Zorua? Either way, Zoroark has fallen, but Oshawott has beaten him or her to that. First, thanks for watching.